Hello everyone. Good morning. I hope everybody's having a good morning this morning. Um, I wanted to show you my breakfast from the food pantry, uh, food bank hall, and I want to give you some tips on how you can um, dress up your oatmeal or add more flavor to it. Now, I'm using the plain oats because that's what kind I got. If I was using the flavored oats, whatever flavor it is and whatever pairs well with that flavor, that's what I would do. Um, I would add stuff to that. Um, but I already have some chopped up apples, okay? And the way I prepare my apples is I use this tool, and it has been a game changer. I think you can get this at the Dollar Tree. And I slice them. And then I cut them real thin and put them in a pot and fry them. And I add a lot of uh, cinnamon, ground cinnamon. And you can get this at the Dollar Tree. You can get it at Aldi. You can get it at Walmart. And I just buy the cheaper brand. I don't buy anything, you know, real expensive. You can buy the organic brands if you want to. You can even buy the organic oatmeal if you're not on a strict budget or if you're not eating from the food pantry. But or sometimes you may get organic from the food pantry but anyway this is what I got so and so in order to sweeten mine you can put honey you can put sugar you can put organic sugar you can put brown sugar you can put coconut sugar whatever you want but I'm using this because it doesn't raise my blood sugar and oatmeal is really good to rid your body of cholesterol and I'm also drinking tea with mine and I'm using the chai stash um uh, chai spice stash tea because it um, goes well with this because I already have cinnamon in this. You can add peanut butter to your oatmeal if you like. You can add peaches. I'm not going to add peaches today because I have my apples and um, this has syrup in it and I've already got my sweetener that I want and I've also added butter to mine. You can also add cream or, or you can add um, milk or whatever you want to it and then I may add a few of these raisins not many I just said a few you can also add uh, some chocolate chips if you like to make your oatmeal tasty I also have this flaxseed that I got at Aldi because it's cheaper this is a non-gmo kind and it, it's really good and I add about a tablespoon or two of that I'm thinking about adding a few of these maybe a few of these and I said a few I didn't say a cupful um, just a little bit, just a little sprinkle, okay, and just a little sprinkle of this, and that way you get your omega-3s, and um, nuts are healthy for you, and raisins are good for you, um, <clears throat> so, but yeah, you can use whatever you like, you can even add flake coconut, but anyway, I'm taking the things that I got from the food pantry, and I'm adding it to my oatmeal, Anyway, um, that's all I'm going to talk about today, and this is our breakfast for today, and um, I also use my electric kittle here. It's a water kittle. I use it. It's been a game changer. That's how I make my son's instant oatmeal, because he uses the organic instant packets that he gets, and um, so this it helps to speed up the process, okay? And so it doesn't take much to make this oatmeal, and it's really quick and easy. You can even eat this when you're camping or at a motel or if you're in an RV or whatever. I mean, this is a great breakfast for anybody. So thank you so much for watching. Please like, share, comment down below. Please uh, subscribe if you're not a subscriber. If you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. And um, hope everybody is having a blessed day. And hit the notification bell so you'll be notified of all of my upcoming videos. And uh, thank you so much for watching.